Hi Cancer, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your reading for June. This is for Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're just going to see what comes up. Keep in mind that this is, if this doesn't resonate at the beginning of the June, watch it in the middle or towards the end. It is for the whole month of June, so it could happen at any time. We're going to get one of these, then we're going to get this deck right here. Attachment! Some of you are attached to something that is not healthy. I can't, I mean, you got to take that mask off. You got to break free. You're attached to something. It's like you're trapped, okay? You got to get unstuck. And the only one that can get you unstuck is you. You may have to wiggle out of it. You, you Whatever you got to, it's, it's like you got to face the truth in a situation. You can't pretend, okay? And I'm sorry, you know, that to start a reading out like that, but... I mean, the card speaks for itself. It flipped over in the deck while I was shuffling. You saw it happen. That's why I shuffle on camera. So that you can see the, the authenticity of what is. Okay? You got to be authentic with yourself. No masks. Okay? We got to be real. We got to get down to the nitty gritty here. We got to see the truth. We can't pretend. We can't make it be what we want it to be, you know. It is what it is. Being authentic, you know, and I'm not saying that you're not being authentic. But sometimes we like to stay attached to things that are unhealthy for us because it's comfortable. It's safe. Now, five is about change. It's about choices. It's a, five is a number of personal freedom. Somebody is not in a state of personal freedom because, as you can see, they're still chained to something that is unhealthy. <clears throat> and now I'm having a hard time with my throat. <coughs> You know, the throat chakra is about speaking your truth. Speak your truth. Be honest, okay? Communicate. Be authentic with yourself. Be authentic with your soul. If you are attached to something that is unhealthy, you must find the strength to wiggle out of it and break free. Life is too short to be wearing masks or to deal with people that wear masks, to deal with people that are not authentic. Somebody's not being authentic here and they are attached to something that is not healthy. It's time to let go of the old and bring in the new, Cancer. This is you needing to realize that you do have a better opportunity, and maybe you are. The Five of Cups Reverse is beginning to realize that there is another opportunity, something better suited for you. This is having faith in a new beginning. You might probably have a new prospect waiting for you. Somebody's at that crossroads and they just need to cross that bridge, but they're reluctant. They're restricting themselves. Two of Wands, reverse, staying in the safe zone. That's what this is. It's time to step outside of your safety zone. You have another opportunity waiting for you. This is no kidding. But you have to make that choice, and fives are about choices as well. Five, five, and two, That this, all of these cards are about the choices that you make. You can choose to live this mundane, safe life where there's really not a lot of emotional fulfillment or you can choose to detach from it. It's your choice. Six of Pentacles. Somebody's holding on to a one-sided situation where there's not a lot of reciprocation. There's not equal give and take.
somebody from the past. It's like clinging to the past. I think we have somebody here that is clinging to the past. Maybe there's some memories with this person that you just can't let go of. You may have an opportunity to connect with somebody else from your past. You may have that opportunity. Maybe you're beginning to realize that there's somebody else that, you know, could reawaken your feelings for love, whatever. Another two. Two of Pentacles reversed. This is avoiding change, avoiding challenge, making poor decisions. Somebody has made some poor decisions. King of Swords, it's time to make a decision and stick to it. But there's lack of ambition. Somebody's lost their focus, they've lost their concentration, and they've lost their drive. Could be dealing with an energy thief here. Somebody that is stealing your energy and you need to be practical. You need to come up with a new perspective. You need to be optimistic. You need to be more logical here. Somebody's taking their power back, so that's great. Somebody's taking their power back after it has been stolen. It's like their energy has been stolen. They've given their power away to somebody. Wow. Look at the people. There's a lot of people with their fingers in the pie. A lot of, a lot of opinions here. We got a lot of opinions that are affecting you. Okay. Somebody has been focused on everything but love, because where's the love? There's love in the past, but where's the love now? That's what I would like to know. Somebody has made some poor decisions, and it maybe has caused their, you know, finances even to go downhill. Seriously. With the Six of Pentacles reversed, the Two of Pentacles reversed, and the King of Pentacles reversed, there could be some financial issues here because somebody has made some poor decisions to attach themselves to something that is stealing their energy, which is which is messing with their focus and their concentration to be successful. So when you when you make the wrong choices, everything else goes downhill. <laughs> So this is, uh, somebody has been dealing with a very cunning, tricky individual, somebody that uh, may just have been using them for money or using them for security. But now we do have somebody that is beginning to realize that there's a better option, so that's good. That's really good. Um, let me make sure that this is focused. This is, this is getting creative, coming up with a new vision. We have somebody here that is, I think we got somebody here that is on the verge of taking a new adventure, taking a new, new approach here. Got this new vision, I'm taking my power back and I'm headed in a new direction. So I think we do have somebody here that is headed in a new direction. It's like a decision has been made. I mean, the matter, I think that you have made a decision or somebody that you're dealing with has, has made a decision. I have to also tell you that I think that we that somebody sees you as very, very attractive. They're very attracted to you. There's an attraction here. I think it's somebody new. I think it's somebody new. Because you have a choice between two. No kidding. There's, there's two options here. You can stay in the past. You can stay stuck to this thing that isn't good for you. Or you can move forward into something that... is more logical. Somebody is definitely making a decision with that King of Swords. Somebody is making a decision to take a new approach towards something that is more attractive to them. But with these two twos reversed, this is imbalance. We have a lot of imbalance here, definitely. Somebody has, somebody's life has been... It's almost like turned upside down because they were focused on the wrong one. The universe doesn't like that shit. Somebody hasn't been practical at all. Irresponsible. Ungrounded. Unrealistic. Dealing with a very, you know, this is like a liar. This could be even lying to themselves, giving their magic away. 
you know, giving their power away. Somebody has been giving their power away to an individual that was only invested in them for the security of it, the money, the, the, the assets, whatever, not love, okay? But I think we got somebody here that is beginning to realize that there's a better option. That's what I think we got here. So I feel like this is a month of somebody making a decision to step outside, to step outside of this <laughs> unrealistic situation. I'm going to detach myself from this. I'm moving in a new direction. You are. You are. It's like you're taking back control. Cancer, you're taking back control of your life. That's what's going on. You're putting yourself in the driver's seat because you want success. I see you replacing that fear and breaking free. No kidding. You're headed out. You're in the driver's seat. You're the boss. And you're moving very quickly in the right direction. That's what I see. You're facing the opposition. And I think that you're making a cut. You are lit I think that you are making some sort. You're breaking that chain. I think you've been dealing with somebody with hidden agendas, which I already knew anyway. I could already see that. You've been dealing with somebody that was just invested for the assets. I can't. I mean, that's what it was. And this is you knowing, and you probably were ignoring it for quite some time. And you definitely had given your power away for quite some time. But I think now you see the hidden agendas. This person put you in a repression. It's almost like they made you lose yourself. And it, holding on to it is getting old. It's a dead end and I think that you know it. It's time to release. And you've held on long enough. I think that it's time to let go and you know it. I think you have a, a more attractive opportunity being presented to you. You can't hide the truth anymore. You can't, you can't hide it. It's, it's too big. The truth is too big. And I think that some truth is being revealed. Some hidden truth is being revealed. I think that if somebody's been keeping secrets, which they have, okay, there's secrets here. There's no doubt that there are some secrets here. The secret is about to be revealed that it's time to move on. Whether you're moving or they're moving, somebody is moving. They're moving on. Because you can't hide the truth. You can't hide it. You can't hide it. You can't. Something that it's like an ending has been delayed because maybe because of codependency. I don't know. But now all that is practical and real is coming coming into to focus. Okay. We have somebody that is finding the discipline to move in a new direction. I got to be practical. I got to be real. Coming out of conflict, somebody has been reluctant. They've been reluctant to stop playing this game, but I feel like we got somebody here that is stepping out. I'm stepping out. I'm going my own way. I'm, I'm going in a new direction. I want victory. I want success. I think a decision is absolutely being made. No progress has been made where they've been at. Six of Wands reverses. There's been no progress here. And now it's time of reevaluation. Sixes are a time of reevaluation. Six, six, six. Somebody is, and, and two of them are reversed. Somebody has been, it's like, I need to reevaluate this situation because there's no victory and success here. And I want victory and success. So I got to take back control of my life to have victory and success. So I think there's potential reconnection with somebody that you have known before, you know, around the corner after you break free from whatever this attachment is that is not healthy for you. Something has stolen your energy and it's brought you down. It has definitely brought you down. And I think that you're realizing the truth. I do see that you're realizing the truth that you have a better opportunity here. And I think you are moving very quickly in the right direction towards something that is more compatible for you. It's time. The time is now to come together to combine with the one that is going to bring you, you know, success. Anyway, I think that you have waited long enough. I think that you have evolved. You're not the same person that you used to be. This is renewal. 
You could be having a reunion with somebody as well, a reunion with somebody that you have known before. This is bringing balance back to your life. This is this is this is coming together with oh some it's like a great combination. You know, it's like combining with something to bring you success. This is this is a great combination. This is combining, this is coming together. There's been some, I mean, the Seven of Swords, this is, this could be coming together with somebody that hurt you in the past, because this is the past. I don't know what's going on here. Are you coming together with somebody that either you hurt them or they hurt you in the past? This could be a, a, a reunion or a reconciliation, I don't know where this is coming from, a reconciliation with somebody that you know, walked away from you or you walked away from them. Maybe you got involved with the wrong one and you got attached to the wrong one and now you got this realization that this other one is actually the one. I don't friggin' know. Anyway, some sort of truth is about to be revealed. No kidding, with the moon reverse. There's been secrets here. Somebody's been keeping secrets about something. And now there's there's been such a significant change within. It's like somebody has really changed. They've really healed. They're not the same person, whether it's you or the person that you're dealing with. We have a big change here. Somebody has evolved into a different person. It's like I think now there's an opportunity to heal a situation, maybe go back. Somebody wants to go back or come back. You may want to go back to somebody or they want to come back to you to heal it. Somebody has changed. They may tell you that they have changed. And I know this reading is going in a different direction, but what I what I feel is like somebody is in is is attached to the wrong thing. Whether it's you or the other person, and I feel like they are detaching to come together with the right one. So however that resonates with you, Somebody is going to come together with the right one after detaching from the wrong one. And it's almost like there's a past life connection here. We got the Empress on the bottom. This is a rebirth. This is the birth of a new life. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Libra. This is a very beautiful soul. This is a... This is a kind, compassionate person who nurtures and loves and can bring abundance. This is the birth of a new life, Cancer. So you got you got a new opportunity here. Where there will be, you know, extreme abundance. This woman is glowing. This woman, uh, she doesn't have to chase she doesn't have to chase. If you are the chaser, you are not this woman. This woman doesn't chase. People flock to her because of her security. She's secure with who she is. She doesn't need to chase. And because she's so secure and she vibrates so highly, somebody's coming to get her. Could be you or if you are the male. Maybe you're going towards this woman. If you are the female and you're in this state where you are not chasing, you know your value, you know your worth, you're beautiful, you're kind, you're generous, you're loving, you're abundant, you're living your best life, you're good, here they come. Somebody sees this woman's beauty and I feel like they're, they're, they're coming after her. So whoever it is, you know, I feel like somebody may want to come back. Somebody is, 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 is heading towards a new life and this is a this is beautiful it really is somebody the truth is about to be revealed okay somebody has been hiding their true feelings and I think the truth is about to be revealed and that's what I got cancer be prepared somebody is detaching they are detaching from an unhealthy situation to come in your direction or it's you detaching to go in another direction okay 
There's breaking free from one attachment and coming together with the right one. And that's what I got. Good luck.